you know how it goes down, innit? But what I'm trying to say is, <laughs> I don't think there's enough meaning for that to happen. I, I, I don't, like, the Fresh Prince, bro. No, no, the reason why I say that is... I what, am legend. What, what, Hancock. No, why I'm saying that... Josh, is, Bad boys. What? Men in black. He's a legend. Josh, look, why I'm saying this is... Even if it didn't connect, who who would have staged this? Because Will Smith bro, got... we up. don't... Let's be real. We yeah. know this, Whether you man. hit him or not... We, uh, we know Will dark shit is going on up in there, And then bro. you're saying... Get your my wife. Yeah, but do you know what I'm saying? It's all distractions. It's all distractions. Do you know what was actually happening on the day of the Oscars? All the world governments were meeting up and they were doing their little shenanigans. Was that on the news? No. What was on the news? What was on the news? Listen to me. What was on the news? I don't know. Will Smith slapping a man at the Oscars when they were meeting up and doing their whole agenda behind the scenes. Stepped outside and she was walking by. Usually zoned out, but she caught my eye. My eyes looking at them vice and then she looked surprised. She said, you're all the same. I replied, I ain't surprised. With them looks, mother do 180s like left hooks connected. Like bodies in bed when the set's good. Interested. Yeah, I see you up with what to do about this put your name and number down the company we are going live in three two one yes yes bench banter season two you know what we do we're back out here on the benches for 2022 you know me by now you know the face you know the name man like <laughs> what's this bro sanuel sanuel <laughs> <laughs> but like Sanuel, San- <laughs> but like Sanuel, and of of course as ever, I'm joined by my one and only brother. Is it Mala? Mufia, Mala move. What language is that? Uh, you are locked. Uh, you are locked. Mala into bench banter. You know it. <laughs> Nah, yeah. Oh, yeah. What did we say? World War Three, Inflation Nation, Will Smith, man, like the Fresh Prince, Fresh Prince. slapping Chris Rock. <laughs> we never seen nothing like this before. I've never seen nothing like this. Mm. I just find it just. What are the chances of it being his first, first time? One? This is what I'm saying. And it's a brother. Apparently, it was the first time Samuel L. Jackson won an Oscar as well, but. Obviously, that was downplayed because of that, that whole, that whole slap, man. Got I up. think they just didn't have enough time after the whole pass out, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Sure. Now, nah, this video has resurfaced in saying that fucking she didn't even want to get married. She didn't want kids. She got pregnant by accident. Like, how would you feel if this is how your partner was chatting about you? It's you mad. See, you see, the thing is, yeah, fair play. Like, this is something that maybe you and your partner might be discussing at home and she, she might or he might be going through something and you're dressing... As a as a as a partnership, mm. but when you start ironing it out in, in front of the public, public, the, the whole public, niche, the world, bro. The thing is, when people start, nothing quite seals the deal more than telling someone something and then they agree with you. Mm. So even if it's a bag of shit, <laughs> but because people are agreeing with you, it kind of makes your shit plausible. Yeah, and I find that 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 might even be the problem, the, the situation in this case. The fact that she feels that she can say, say it, it such a, a, an so open boldly, yeah. like so, because she wants that whole maybe the, just to maybe she just needs to express it. Maybe a problem shared is a problem. Mm. But me, for me, I find that when you do stuff like that, like if I have a problem and I go and talk to my boys about it, and even if I'm chatting shit, my boys would be like, "Yeah, yeah no, yeah, bro, it's true, it's true." Yeah. It makes me feel less of a it makes me feel less accountable mm. for the whole situation. It makes me see it as if it's actually me that's right and. The, Yo, what, look what, at that beef, fam. No PPE, no wet, <laughs> no PPE. Hey, hey. Nah, nah, I gotta nah. listen to it, bro. We're not saying the lyrics right at all, fam. I'm not living with that. You get the most sick cool Z. You know, to them, this stuff is. He's saying E, he's saying E, bro. He's saying. He's saying. <laughs> right, Joe. <laughs> he's saying. <laughs> Don't want to know if I want to get onto this, but like the whole female friendships being different to male friendships. Uh, I don't even know if I'm gonna get onto this man for the getting my DMs from <laughs> the feminists. Can I ask you to get down from my track, no, please? No, no. Well, I can't talk for women, and I, I can't surely talk for women because I'm not one. Mm. But 
what I see will tend to see is guys tend to be a little bit more laid back like you might have a bit of an altercation with someone mm. and tomorrow you're talking to that person or it even might be a situation where you've, you distance yourself from someone but it's not even like it's all love but you're gracious enough to say mm. wagwan or what are you saying or yeah and, yeah and keep it keep it keep it moving yeah but what i've noticed yeah someone's calling okay what's saying man you all right yeah man what, what, what's happening it's not my time i'm making my way home now from where <laughs> from where <laughs> were well, you coming out tonight you coming sway what are you not going sway yeah yeah man no no man. i got work at, i got work at four i need to go home have a shower in the uh <laughs> Sunglasses at night. No teens over. It's now time to reveal who you think is the weakest link. Roger. Roger. Brenda. Brenda. But I don't know, man. I feel like socialising has become... It's, I think it's more difficult. Now. It's mad different after the whole pandemic. I just feel like people are a bit weird around each other now. I feel like even prior to the pandemic, Josh, man. You think people are becoming I a think, bit weird? I think, beyond, to be honest, I think our parents' generation and those that like maybe have parents of 40, mm. you know, 40s, 50s, you know, early 40s to say. that Not even, actually, let me, let me even bring it down to 35. Mm. We've, yeah, 35. Mm. That's close, close for me. Yeah, but let's say 20. Yeah, okay, let's just, let's just say 30. <laughs> let's just swear it all off. Let's just say 30. <laughs> they're, they're different. Their communications like that. Yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? That's how our parents were able to tell us what friends are. Do you yeah. know what I'm saying? Who are your friends? Do yeah. you know what I'm saying? I think now... Do you think we struggle with communicating with each yeah, other now? Yeah, 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 yeah. I, you know, when I started to realise it is when when you used to smile at people. Yeah. Like, out of just being polite and yeah. mourning to you kind of thing. And they'll look at, you, look at you straight like, are you trying to move to them? Yeah. Hi, everyone. Hi. I noticed in society, a lot of people find it easier to communicate using their phone. Comfy. <laughs> yeah, 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 we're just yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Have a good day. I feel like the, the thing with the whole social media, yeah? This, social this, media this, fucked this everything guys, up, man. Yeah, is, it's too convenient. Mm. And anything that's worthwhile should never be convenient. Mm. Your friend says, meet me here at six o'clock. <sighs> you meet your friend there at six o'clock. Not right. this, oh, bro, sorry. Give me 10 minutes, because yeah. I do it, you, you do, do it. it. We you all do it bare, bro. It's not about having 10 top friends on your yeah. MySpace. It's about having millions, 50 million, With all these whatever, people. But, but this is what I'm saying. I'm, this, yeah, this is what I was saying. Half I'm, of these people don't even talk to you or even know you. Yeah, I don't think I don't think as humans we're designed to like be in big groups of people because you, as a like government, they can't cater to all of the people that are your 
under your care do you know what I'm saying people are slipping through the cracks people are getting forgotten only a certain um, section of society are the ones that are kind of benefiting from the way things are so it's like I think maybe we're designed to be in like little communities of people just doing what we gotta do but these mega corporations need us to be in these kind of I don't know man these Metaverse. Metropolitan cities because it's Metaverse. Metaverse. They want, they want us all controlled. They want us all centralized. Mm. And the likes of these social networks are making it. It's make. It's not that I'm digging at social networks because it's obviously it's to bring people together. But bringing people too much together, it's not a good thing. It's not a good thing, and that's that's the problem we we see. Look here, like do you see the whole celebrity thing? Look at this whole with Jada Jada Smith and is it Jada Smith? Fair play. We get to see certain things on YouTube or conversations that they've had on the red table or whatever, but God knows the conversations that they're having mm. after that shit has been aired. Mm. Do you get what I'm saying? How do you feel? How do you think Will Smith feels? feels yeah. Jaden Smith, Willow Smith. I'm looking feels, at him, I'm thinking. Thinking, right, these people are my age, mate, and this is what they have to say about my parents. <laughs> Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Celebrities, we, we give them too much attention because social media is allowing that. Yeah. I think people in general are just becoming too diluted, man. Yeah. Interesting vote, guys. Interesting round. Bender, why did you vote for us? Oh, we just got a few questions wrong, I'm afraid. You got a few questions wrong yourself there as well, love. Yeah, but not as much as you. Roger, with four votes against you, I'm afraid you are the weakest link. Goodbye. I would have had conversations with my missus, mm. right? Before getting there. Mm. I told her, listen, this is the Oscars. Do you know there's comedians that are gonna be presenting? We're sitting at the front. Mm. Do you know what I'm saying? Don't feel like you're gonna be targeted. I'm not gonna feel like I'm being targeted. You would have told that said that to your missus. I said that man, you watched Nutty Professor. Yeah. <laughs> And was it not Jada Pinkett was, that was said, come on, let's leave, man. She, it happened to her and fat, the fat man, innit? Oh, no. Who is sucking whose titties over here? <laughs> come on, girl, you should have been well aware what happens when you go to these comedy things and you go and sit at the front. Like, fair play, I can understand, obviously. I don't want to talk too much about the race thing, but mm. sometimes I can understand, like, when when black women feel like oh it's always a black man to say yeah. something. But I'll be honest and say this. On a statistic base statistic basic basis, black men probably have most experience with black women. There ain't gonna be no white man to talk about a black woman. Yeah. Cause trust me, if he does, we know what to turn up. <laughs> Do you know what I'm saying? We know it. So the best person that could probably make a remark like that is either a black woman mm. or a black man. Yeah. Because a black man can know, knows what experiences that a black woman goes, goes through. through. We got black female family. Do you know what I'm saying? We got members. Like we got family members. Do you yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like not all of our sisters have long hair. Yeah. Do you know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah. Like. Do you know what I'm saying? Like for for I, personally, I don't think. I think the joke was enough for Jada Pinkett to roll her eyes up, but mm. I don't think it was enough for him to go and slap him in it. For your wife, bun that man. Yeah. It wasn't for your wife, but <laughs> give him like proper like. I actors, still, I like, still think it was staged though, man. I think it was nah, staged. I don't think it was staged. You don't think it was staged? Nah, nah, nah. nah. It was the staged, and that we didn't actually see his hand connect to his face. If you think about it. Now, do you know why I say this, Josh? Yeah. If it was Martin Scorsese and Robert De Niro or, you know what I'm saying, someone that's like proper prominent, that proper Hollywood beacons, mm. yeah, then fair play, I can say maybe there might be a conspiracy, maybe something is actually happening in Hollywood. Mm. But I'll be honest with you. Will Smith is a Hollywood icon, bro. Well, Are I'm you mad? Com compared to Robert De Niro. Compared to Denzel They're Washington. all the same level. Bro. Will Smith think, is up. I don't, I don't think he's on Will Smith. I don't think Will he's Smith is up Denzel there, bro. Washington's Will level. Smith is a Hollywood. I think, I think he's a if Hollywood Will Smith, superstar. Even if you didn't rep Will Smith, if he bought through this park right now, you're going to yeah. be like, oh my God. <laughs> Fresh Prince. Oh, you know, like, you know how it goes down. You have to think about why things happen. They want... They want to distract us from what they're actually doing. Mainstream, all of this thing, they're all in collusion with each other. No, but my point is this, yeah. 
Okay, yeah, to distract people because at the end of the day, when the when the Romans weren't happy, I mean, when the the locals in Rome in Rome weren't happy, they'll throw on the, the, the exactly what, the gladiators. They distracted them even. But then, what I'm bro. trying to say is, look, at the end of the day, these big companies, yeah, I see it as this corporate greed. These companies, even if there's the G summits or whatever, these big things that happen in, mm. in the world is, these companies need money. Yeah, and it's not about look, money no more, bro. Josh, look, money need, system, but you need money to have control. And yeah? They've got all the money. No, they have, they've just, got all of the money. The, bro. Reason, the reason why <laughs> I say this is, think? I don't think, I don't think Chris Rock and Will Smiths. I'm not escapade. talking about these no, man, bro. These men are puppets. That, that, even that escapade. Look, at the end of the day. The, 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 the channels are airing these things No, that We're sponsored by Pfizer Brought to you by Pfizer CNN Tonight Brought to you by Pfizer Early start Brought to you by Pfizer Friday night on Aaron Burnett out front Brought to you by Pfizer This week with George Stephanopoulos Is brought to you by Pfizer exactly. Okay, okay, let's say Okay, they are sponsored by Pfizer yeah. But what I'm trying to say is They get money because they're getting views No one's going to be how many, how many millions of people Do you think will be interested Watching this summit That's going on with the world decisions If we'll sm- Everyone wants to know about Exactly everyone wants to know about, Because that's how everyone be No, but it's not Why about just, It's not about Listen you, look, look, This ha- is why I always say this, yeah not listen to what the news is supposed to be bro entertainment in general oversells everything yeah how come a football a brain surgeon right this is someone that's gone to school for seven eight years is paid less than a football player why because sixty thousand people rock about a game yeah it's not about the fucking yeah but that's about eyes that's not what the news is supposed to be about that unfortunately that's what it is about and i'm saying this is what i'm saying things like this are just distract distractions bro can you not see that you think if will smith didn't not that slap didn't happen at the oscars that would have been all over the news Nothing newsworthy happened at the Oscars, but that same day no, something then, something else newsworthy did happen. No, but there's a lot more to it, man. Like, it's like you know, you, have you seen these that Klaus Schwab guy? Seen these pictures of him putting on all these ceremonial robes like he's fucking Darth Maul, bro. This is the shit people don't know, but it's just happening behind the scenes because we're looking at Will Smith slapping Chris Rock at the Oscars. Yeah, I don't really give a fuck about all this stuff. Exactly. Yeah, just carry on living your life, man. <laughs> You man don't love me. Man's out here on these streets by myself. Could get robbed and that. Could get fucked up, but my brother's left me. In fact, nah, no, fuck that. You look mad. Your mum's out there banking, 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 banking. You might want to vote me weakest link then. Now that you see it's coming, it's coming to crunch time. You want to try and get rid of me now. Are you look sick. You didn't even get a single question right that whole round. Listen, Brenda, you better wind your goddamn neck in because I don't feel no way about slapping a woman in the air and telling you that for free. Mud. You can't just let him talk to me like that. You know what? Run me my share of the prize money. Bro, that's not how the show works, man. What well, part of this looks like I give a shit, bro? Man's out here wilding out on national TV. Or you're telling me this ain't how the game works? The fuck I look like I care, bro? Bro, Josh, I say this all the time here. There's, there's some things that us as brothers have, have endured, you know? Mm. And, and look where we are now still. Mm. Do you know what I'm saying? And everyone, everyone can see overtly, every, explicitly, this shit is unfair. Mm. These people are treated like this, these people are treated like that. But this is even prior to even civil rights. Mm. This is just humans. Mm. Just, just being evil. And I feel like evil is now, it's not even like... Evil is commonplace. Evil is just except even on our TV shows we support evil characters, bro. Let's be real. Breaking Bad, like, yeah. we supported him. We liked Walter White, yeah. but he was an evil character. 
Look at Snowfall. Snow, he's, a, new, he's an e- we still we still wouldn't want him to die. Do you know why? Because those that know, at the end of the day, unfortunately, in this world is a sucker born, isn't it? And unfortunately, good people are pushed to the extreme that they have to commit evil things to get where they to get their voices heard. That's the reality. The system from the root is rotten. Do you know what I'm saying? And there's no like, the, listen, Joshua. Unfortunately, when the tree is rotten, the tree eventually decays and dies. But no fucking leaf is changing that tree. We can there can be billions of leaves on that tree, but no leaf. Eventually, the, when the leaf passes its sell by date, it dies. When the tree needs to go, it goes. When the system that breaks, it goes. But every tree, every fl- every fl- pl- plant, or every flower on that leaf on that tree, sorry, even when the tree's rotten, can't do nothing. Do you know what I'm saying? It's something wow. that you're born you're born into, and it's instilled. And all you can do is acknowledge it, appreciate it, and try and. Be better in it. Do you know what I'm saying? You're a fucking passionate one, boy. I'm like philosopher. I, it's, that's what it's about. I've never heard that saying before. But when it, we're all part of the thing. We're all part of the. But thing. this is what you have to think about. What does the tree look like without its leaves? Unfortunately, broken. Dead. And who are the leaves? People. The people. The, the leaves do fall. The, the, the tree is, is decaying and it's falling, but it's always the last to go. The system will always be the last to go. The people will be the pet, bro. Listen, at the end of the day, when Hiroshima was fucked up in Japan, right? Hiroshima is a derelict land. The land is still there, mm. but the people are no more. Mm. They've moved to different parts. The land is still there. The rotten system that governed that ground is still there. Look at Chernobyl. The rotten, the land is still there. It's rotten. The people aren't around it. Mm. Or there might be one, two, one, two scattered around. But that's, that's what it goes down to. The system is too much. Do you know what I'm saying? I system needs to change. System and it broke like fitted well. Playing with the taps until below the liquid fell. Blurry details got me waking up. Last thing on the mind, she called the captain duck. Where did she go? Where did she go? But I feel rough. Hung over. Obviously, yes, that was us. Episode one, season two, bench banter, locked and loaded. If you haven't already, catch up on season one. But yeah, you know how it goes by now. I'm gonna pass you over to my brother to leave us off with our saying of the week. Listen, yeah, there's an old African saying. How does it go? Um, get this one, yeah. When there's no food, even the lion will eat grass. <laughs> you like that one, innit? <laughs> yum, 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 yum. <laughs> Stepped outside and she was walking by. Usually zoned out, but she caught my eye. My eyes looking at them fights and then she looks surprised. She said, You're all the same. I replied, I ain't surprised. With them looks, mother do 180s like left hooks connected. Like bodies in bed when the set's good. Interesting.